good morning everybody welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here so today i'm filming a little home vlog it's just gonna be a really chill one we're gonna be at home i've done my skincare as you can see if i look a bit shiny that's my spf hello everybody welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here so today i'm filming a little home vlog it's just gonna be a really chilled out one I'm gonna spend the day at home i have so much to do so i am going away for the very first time on my own who is she my first solo holiday sort of solo sort of not <clears throat> i'm meeting my friend there so we are going to be together but it is my first time going on a plane on my own without my kids without my husband without my family essentially and Gosh, I'm almost 30 and I've never gone on a plane on my own. But anyway, it's my first time traveling alone. I'm really, really excited. And I'm also really nervous. Not because I don't know how to, because I do. Okay, I've been on so many holidays with these lot that I know the drill. But it's different because I have kids now. And I'm going to miss them. But I do think it's really, really important as a parent, especially a mother, because... You know, my husband's been going away for work when he was working so often. And he's, of course, traveled on his own in a plane. I haven't. And I think I think I should, you know. I think it's about time that I start doing things out of my comfort zone. And I start taking time out for myself. And that is really, really important because the strain that motherhood has on you is immense and i feel like more people should talk about taking time out for yourself doing something for yourself and not be like shamed for it because i know a lot of people would shame the mom for doing stuff like going on holiday but not the dad you know but yeah i'm really really excited um i told yeah. happy birthday mom oh my god it's not my birthday girl oh Come on, bye. Show me. Thank you so much. Ah, how pretty. They even smell really nice. It's not my birthday, guys. These were very kindly gifted from uh, Flowered. I'm going to put the name on the screen. They are so kind to send me flowers. It is Friday morning. It is Jum'ah. And Jum'ah is the most beautiful, beautiful day in the week for us. And the fact that they send me flowers on a Friday. Thank you guys. It's so pretty. Mom, Look at it as well. It's packaged so nice. Mom, I got some, so I got some research. Yeah. Pretty. You really like them? Yeah, Okay, but don't pull it, okay? Be super gentle. We don't want to, like, damage them. Which one's your favourite? Show me your favourite. She likes the roses. My girl. <laughs> anyway, guys, I was talking to her about it yesterday. She wasn't very happy. Because um, she's super attached to me. She even sleeps in the same bed as me. Don't you, Liana? Yeah. Yeah. I don't but I had to explain to her that, you know, it won't be for long and I'll come back. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it in front of her because I don't want her to get extra upset. But, um, yeah, so okay, today... Okay. About what, darling? What you were saying. Oh, okay. I won't get upset. You won't get upset? Yeah. I love you. How do I even get upset? I love you so much, Liana. I don't even get upset, though. No, of course not. But Liana, it's, good. it's okay to be upset, you know. It's normal. Look who I do. Oh, lovely. Yeah. So anyway, um, moving on. Today, I am going to be packing. I am going to be making some delicious lamb and potato curry. Mmm. I, I, I eat that. You eat that? It's your favourite, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. The main priority is to really get packing. And I'm going to show you guys how easy it is when it's just on your own. I'm not going for long. Less than a week. So... I'll show you. I'm not. Mom, I don't. Where can I help you make that? Of course you can. The kids have now broken up for the summer holidays, so they're officially. Summer holidays is my birthday. Yeah, school's officially out, and fun is gonna start, isn't it, Liana? Yeah, 
they have so many plans with their dad so they're gonna have a really fun time they've got so many things like um pizza making thing in central like he's planned out everything to do with them so it's nice they're gonna have so much fun while i'm away but yeah i'm gonna be packing today i'm going to be i'm going on sunday right Can I today's friday and so i don't have long but i don't mind packing the day before because it's on my own isn't it oh hello let's go put these beautiful flowers in a vase yeah i got some uh well i got some books that i really want to see normal size hmm? also, mm -hmm. can I be uh, hello kids mm -hmm. oh. mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Lovely company on Instagram sent me a little package, so I thought I'd show you guys since I'm about to use it on Liana. We have, you know, what this is it stimulates like the blood flow in your hair before you um, oil it and you also can use it in the shower it's stronger than your hands so I'm just gonna do this so it just gets the blood flowing oh my goodness we've got a new water spray bottle guys a better one as well so cool here you go oh, wow. water. Ooh, we've got um, intense hair mask no magic hair care by the Ooh, way intense hair mask conditioner and a shampoo i didn't know they did conditioner enriched with 100 percent pure natural hemp seed paraben free no, and free, 100 vegan oh well done that's really good liana so a shampoo conditioner and i'm really excited about the hair oil which is organic hair serum thickening and volumizing hair oil with blends of antioxidants so i'm gonna use the oil right now no but for real for real one sec Mom, I need a lint for this. Can you see how strong of a colour that is? A box! This hair oil smells <laughs> good, good. And by the way, um, they gifted this to me and I didn't have to share it or anything. It's good to support a small business, especially a Somali owned business. So make Mom. sure you support, check them out. I'll leave them on the screen or in the description box below actually. They're on Instagram, TikTok, I think. Is the voice on? Yeah. Yep. Breakfast in the making. It's currently 12 o'clock and wow. I'm hungry. So I'm making some breakfast. Yes, darling. I'm gonna add some eggs and have it with some toast. The summer holidays are not for the week, especially if you work from home and you have kids at home. You have to entertain them, feed them like a hundred times a day because I've been handing out snacks too, too often because I'm like, wow, you guys get two breaks in a day in school, in six hours. You get a break time and a lunch time and that is it. That's the only two times that you guys actually eat and have snacks. But here, it has to happen on demand. But anyway, I've just sat here, finished my movie. I started watching a film actually this morning. Had a little bit of laying and then I carried it on when I was making my breakfast, as you guys saw. And then I finished it off while I was eating my breakfast and it was so, so good. It was super interesting and so gripping. So on Sky Cinema this month, there are three top picks. There is A Man Called Otto, which I'm gonna pop it on the screen when it's out. Dungeons and Dragons, Honor Among Thieves. Really, really wanting to watch A Man Called Otto, but my husband said, wait for me because it has Tom Hanks in there. But I went with Maggie Moore because it was one of those films that has the suspense, the thriller. It's got the, what's that thing called? Let me just tell you guys what it's about. It's about a police officer who starts to unravel a web of lies when he starts to investigate a murder of two girls. Both of the girls' names are Maggie Moore. And he's basically investigating it and to see who murdered her. And as he's doing that, 
there's a few suspects and there's a lot of shady things going on basically i don't want to spoil it too much i don't know if this is going to spoil it a bit but maggie moore's husband um he got found with a possession um an envelope of something and the wife started going crazy basically and threatened to go to the police so he called up this hitman and said just scare her he didn't scare her he and then they found out there's another lady called Maggie Moore so to cover that murder up they had to go and do another one and more and more people just keep getting killed and it's up to the police officer to find out what happened who did it and it gets so good towards the end it started to get a bit slow at the beginning it was really really good then in the middle it got a bit slow for my liking it picked up towards the end where I was shocked literally gobsmacked I was like oh! literally if i see but yeah i would recommend it i'll probably give it about seven out of ten but i will pop a link to all of the films in the description box below there are so many pop-ups on sky cinema this month but the one that i'm looking forward to watching with the kids is charlie and the chocolate factory minions and one that i really want to watch on my own that i have never watched is notting hill i can't believe i've never seen that film i thoroughly enjoyed having a slow morning with the movie i'm gonna wash liana's hair on the sink today as per her request you ready yeah come there oh i love your shoes is it better okay so i'm gonna get water i'm gonna make sure it's nice and warm for you okay relax you can relax okay if you're, you're a good girl you can just relax, relax. Oh, this smells nice. Can I smell it? It smells like peppermint. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. Your hair? Your hair? No. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> <laughs> Mommy's putting conditioner in your hair now. Hello. Hello. What's your name and what's her name? Right girls, so Liana is sat there with her hair mask on and I'm going to give it about half an hour. She's having her late, late lunch and then my husband's going to come back from Jama with Malik and he's going to take them to Camden in his brother's area. So they're going to chill there whilst I get on with my packing. Mm. I've just had like some amendments to do from work and it's friday and i'm thinking because i was planning to just pack today not planning to touch any type of work i've handed in everything alhamdulillah it's crazy that like when i'm in a rush or when i've got a holiday booked and i get everything done on time but when you have the whole month i procrastinate and do it at the very last minute i'm one of those people anyway um yeah he's gonna take them so i'm so grateful he's just gonna take them out so i'm at home on my own i get so much more done without the kids here as you can tell because liana loves loves to glue herself onto me she just loves it bless her and i love her to bits but when i'm trying to pack i can't like entertain at the same time and i just take forever to do stuff so i'm gonna get my packing done i might might not film like a little reel of pack with me type of thing with my suitcase let's see how that goes and yeah i'm gonna show you guys how many outfits i'm taking i'm only going for four nights by the way so i'm gonna do like four outfit four day outfits or like should i should i do four day outfits on four evenings yeah because when we go in to refresh and like go out for the evening we don't want to wear the same thing you know so yeah i'm gonna take four day outfits on four evenings and yeah, just gonna pack my toiletries and everything, leave my skincare to like the day of. And I'm gonna do a few reels I've planned to do. So follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. I'm always like forgetting to post things on shorts and on TikTok. I always post on Instagram first, so follow me on Instagram. That's the number one place where I post things first. That's it, that's the plan for today. And then we'll make dinner. We're gonna eat together. And chill the house is a tip but guess what none of my business is always a tip especially the lounge right now liana malik both and play the toys are everywhere and you know what i'm not in the business of cleaning up just so that they can mess it all up again in an hour no i'm just going to clean the areas 
like the kitchen you know the stuff that's in constant visible like i can see and it annoys me this i've let it just it is what it is <laughs> we're not gonna worry about it okay and i do try to get out for a walk every day even for half an hour so i'm gonna have gonna squeeze a walk in with you guys later uh, possibly after I've packed because tomorrow I have to refilm some things for work before I fly off because so we can send it off on Monday um, so today has to be packing done for me they have gone they went about half an hour ago actually and just had this arrived so I'm gonna show you what I bought in here let's pop this down and then I'm going to start cooking because I'm getting hungry now. I had my breakfast at like 12, right? It's 5.30, 5.40. I'm so hungry. So I just picked up some essentials and some new things. So this is an essential. I absolutely love this CeraVe Facial Moisturizing Lotion SPS 50. I'm going to link it below. It is just so good. Ooh. Let me show you guys. It just disappears. I'm gonna put some on this hand too, actually. Can you see? Can you see? No white cast. No white cast whatsoever. I love that for my face. And I got this for myself because my husband stole mine. He loves it as well. And then I've got my Mitchum deodorant. I've never had this one before. Some new bits banana bright vitamin C C stick for like covering up the dark marks in the face before you put your foundation on and stuff so got that it's like a clear gloss i'm gonna take it on holiday and last but not least this real techniques brush for your under eyes brightening concealer this is really popular on tiktok so anyway that's everything i got i'll link it all below I promise I won't forget this time, okay? And um, yeah, I'm sick and tired of me. Whenever I go on holiday, I have the need to just get everything new. I'm sick of myself. I'm gonna have a little snack actually. Because when the boys went to Masjid, they came back bearing gifts. I got this for me because I love me some Snickers. It's my favorite, favorite chocolate in the whole wide world. I'm gonna eat both of them because why not? I'm gonna have that with tea actually, once my um, curry is cooking. I was gonna cook it on the stove, and then I was like, who am I kidding? It's gonna take forever, it's lamb. I'm just gonna use my Instant Pot. Honestly, that thing is a game changer. If you cook chicken, lamb, it honestly, it halves the time that you cook in. So if I was to use my stove now, the lamb curry will take me a while because I'll need the lamb to be super soft so I'll leave it for like two hours and that's electricity, that's gas, okay, that's money so get yourself an instant pot in 20-30 minutes your meat's soft or a pressure cooker I'll leave the instant pot that I have in the description box below I actually did a recipe for it if you guys have been here that long I did like four recipes in my instant pot I'm gonna link that below but Mm. Mm. first things first soaking my rice i should have made this ages ago but i was faffing around for about an hour trying to put my outfits together for this holiday i like to try on my outfit with the hijab and everything Put them together because it makes life so much easier when you're there even though i'm very indecisive and i will mix and match mm. i like to do that i like to spend a bit of time organizing the outfit so that i know exactly what i'm wearing i'm gonna soak this now and just leave it and wash it later i'm gonna give it like 40 minutes that well however long the meat takes to cook Onion. So this is how I organize everything. 
These are all the outfits with shoes. They're new by the way, so they're not dirty. <laughs> I can put them together with the hijabs and I've put my jewelry all there. And that's the thing that I take for, what do you call it? The bathroom stuff. But yeah, this is everything. I still have a few more outfits to add, but yeah. That's and I'm also going to show you some of the things that I ordered from Amazon that are going to be a lifesaver, such as like the handheld steamer. So I've got a steamer already, but I bought a travel one, like a small compact one, because I don't like using irons. And sometimes you go to hotel rooms, you have to request it nowadays. Steamer is just quick and easy, you know? I got some packing cubes, I've got two of them. So that's that. And here is this handheld steamer that I got. And look at it. So this is how small it is, okay? With the wire and everything. It's so compact. It's so tiny. It's the size of my hand. I'm really excited to use this. I love how small it is. Definitely recommend it because I'm not going to be... I've got 20 kgs, girl. I'm not going to be lugging my huge steamer. And this is going to come in handy for when I go like on short trips and stuff. I still can't believe that I'm going away without my kids and my husband because that is madness to me. I can't believe it. I can do it. I can do this. Is I know I can do it. Why am I talking to myself and telling myself I can do it? I'm a grown ass woman. I can do it, but I'm just going to miss it a lot. Last month, I got this in the black set and... I fell in love with it. It's the one that I wore in the video where Mali got his haircut on Instagram and I loved it that much. I bought the beige. This is what it looks like. I absolutely love it. It's like wide leg. It's quite long at the back. As you can see, it's got a little slit here. I got the shirt in a medium and I got the trousers in a small. I have the black one in a small top and like I think small bottoms as well but I prefer the medium top I like this look a lot more I'm going to link in the description box below for you guys but I love this colour I'm going to wear it travel day I'm going to wear like a white no black top inside black shoes I don't know what shoes yet maybe converses I don't know but I love this I feel like this is such a summer look I love linen. I will link this in the description box below. I love my black set so much that I had to get this. And I love that I can mix and match it now. And I can even wear the top with like black satin skirt and so on. That's what I like about cords. I love that you can wear the top with something else. Wear the trousers with something else and mix and match. Perfect, isn't it? And look. I'm going to go all <laughs> beige and white with the sandals. This is another outfit that I have for my holiday if I want. If I want it, with this bag, black sandals, these ones here. Maybe I don't need to pack any more. Maybe that's enough and I can just mix and match, yeah? As long as I have my nice evening outfits for some nice pics, I'm good. I also need to take like two pyjamas. That's it. So I'm about to go on a hot girl walk. Mm -hmm. And then I realized I needed to return an ASOS package. So I'm gonna be using my handy dandy like address remover. How do I show you guys this in action without showing you guys my address? Right, let me wipe it off first. Wipe my address off and then I can show you. Can you see that? We use it for letters, we use it for all sorts. If you don't have a shredder at home, this is really good. Um, yeah, that's it, I'm making a return on my walk. I've been walking every single day so far. Apart from the weekend, it's Saturday today, so I won't be doing that tomorrow. And the funny thing is, today I haven't stepped foot outside not one second have I been out and I'm on 7,682 steps and it is 8 o'clock. Granted, that's not that good, okay? 
eight o'clock in the evening, you know, but I haven't stepped foot outside. So I think that's great for somebody who hasn't stepped foot outside. Usually if I'm just working on the laptop, I'll be lucky if I get 3000 steps. So I'm gonna go and get myself 10,000 steps. But me being on 7,000, I'll be honest, I'm aiming for 15,000 steps. If I'm allowed on their way home now, they took the train, so they should be here in like 30 minutes, but food's ready. I've stuck Malik's lasagna in the oven because he really wanted lasagna today. His dad done that for him. And I've made the curry for everyone else. Liana loves curries. She loves it with like yogurt. Absolutely devours it. I really fancied a curry. I couldn't make it spicy. That's the only thing that really annoys me. But it's all right. Um, I had a bowl of cereal right now because I need fuel for my walk. The sun has decided to grace us with its presence around eight o'clock. All day has been gloomy, but alhamdulillah, no rain, which is great. But yeah, dinner's ready, everything's ready. I'll show you guys the food um, when I'm eating it later. But for now, I'm gonna go on my little hot girl walk and get some fresh air. I always feel much clearer. I haven't finished with all the outfits. I only need like two more, I think. I'm trying to get something casual because everything's very whoa and extra, but that's the vibe when we're on holidays, isn't it? Let's be honest. Who wants to be basic when you can be extra? <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. In fact, I'm going to do a giveaway. So only the people that have made it to this point, make sure you put a bunch of sunshine emojis, sunshine and airplane emojis in the comments below. And that is your entry to the giveaway. And make sure you like the video as well. And make sure you're subscribed because I'll check all of that when I'm picking a winner. And it'll be such a shame because in the past I have picked a winner and then they weren't subscribed. But they commented. So make sure you subscribe and I'll do you guys a nice little package with makeup, mm, fragrances. I've got so much stuff that I buy that I don't use. Honestly, it's no PR stuff. Stuff that I'm paying for myself. Just to say thank you for watching my videos and being subscribed to my channel. I really, really appreciate every single one of you that actually takes the time to watch all the way through. Because this is a secret giveaway, don't tell anybody the giveaway. Just put the sunshine and the airplane emoji. And you will be entered into the giveaway. And you can comment as many times as you want. But it will be like one of those random generators. And you'll see who the winner is in my next video probably. Or the one after that when I come back from holiday. So I'll pick one. No, I'll pick one in the next video. It'll be my holiday vlog. So I'll pick one at the end of that one. Yeah, I'll pick the winner in the end of that vlog inshallah. So yeah, thank you so much. It is literally just to say thank you to you guys that have made it to the end. <laughs> That's it. Anyway, I'm going to go now. I'll catch you soon. I don't want it to get dark on me. And see ya. Oh, I'll show you the food before this video ends. So watch to the end, okay?